guys all right we are back with another eminem reaction continuing the album we got road rage uh featuring dim joints and sly piper i believe sly piper was on habits was he not was he the chorus i believe so all right anyway let's go uh like comment share subscribe it really helps out uh definitely appreciate any subscriptions you can throw my way if you're if it's your first time here please consider doing that uh guys it's very important that you share these videos as well these things for some reason are just not doing that great maybe i don't have a lot of eminem fans as subscribers i'm not sure uh certainly doesn't seem like it i've got 20 views 20 something views on the last two videos i've done of eminem his brand new album i don't know what's going on i've got over 2400 subscribers that's like 1%, basically, which is ridiculous. Anyway, all right, guys, let's jump into it. I'm going to keep going, but let's see who he's going to go after this time because he's gone after quite a few people. He he roasted Diddy last time, of course. That was one of the most insane things I've ever heard, the way he put it. But anyway, let, let's jump in, guys. Here we go. Uh, Road Rage. Just hold up in the oh. rapture trying to Damn. be a Hold on. This I rap shit divided my panty lines. Mm. Which side are you on? Pussy. Social media got you fucking in Panama. Mm. Damn, why that line so long? Rookie. I'm Ooh. just caught up in the rapture trying to be a rap star. I'm gonna make it out alive. alive. I'm a master at masquerading and acting like I ain't faded. Only I can see yeah. through my disguise. I walk around more confused. Then my aunt Linda's man friend, a black transgender clan what? member who's a Caitlyn Jenner fan and a what? member of Grinder and Tinder. Head MD is in the band yeah. in the apartment while I'm dancing uh, around yeah. all these names and labels that I can't. My aunt's man friend who's a black transgender K. I don't even know what they were to begin with. I don't even know because he, he he said so much stuff there. A black transgender Caitlyn Jenner fan. Who knows? So he could be talking about a dude that tried to change himself to a woman or. Could be talking about a woman originally, her his aunt's man friend, so it could be a woman. I, I have no idea what he's talking about there, but anyway, just crazy. It's craziness out there. What is going on? What the fuck? Rise now, my antennas are up on this PC shit. I'm finna mm. go out on my shield of Cap Dinner. Huh? America, transcender. Oh, okay, Cap. I'm fixing to go out on my shield like Captain America. Of course, Captain America has a shield. M's a big comic book fan. He always throws a comic book reference. Not always, but a lot of times he does. Usually it's about him killing him or something. <laughs> So anyway, he, he he let Captain America off the hook a little bit there. All right, let's go. I'm finna go out on my shield of Captain America, transcender. Mm. Give me a wrong rage reason to black the fuck out and okay. roll they eat. Road rage, rule, rule, rule. Okay. Fuck that red light up. Okay, so road rage. Give me, give me a road rage incident. I'm just, I'm dying to let loose all this anger, all this aggression, all this frustration because of how fucking soft the world is right now. So just give me a reason. I get in a road rage accident. I get in a, something happens on the road where, uh, you know, that's gonna piss you off in itself. That alone, much less that with all the anger you're carrying, carrying around, with all the hostility you have about everything going on in the world in society today. That's the perfect excuse to just black out and go crazy. How could I say some shit so mean? Damn. They're trying to make my mouth close like it's clothing. It's what Ooh. it is though, but this is show this old things ain't never really truly over till Lizzo sings. Like <laughs> Things ain't no, truly over till Lizzo sings, Fat Lady sings, all right. Ain't never really truly over till Lizzo sings, like yeah. I won't say that. We should coddle fat people, yeah, yeah here's a concept, what? let's celebrate onset. Yeah. Diabetes, and instead of us dieting, we can just have a pie eating contest. <laughs> and we should be extra nice, what? instead of blindness, and instead of exercise, what? it's easier to find a triple exercise. Oh my god! Need to change so you don't have to Hold on, no, I gotta, I gotta go back, I gotta go back, here we go. Here we go, Slim. I'll go ahead and tell you, I'm not crazy about this beat, but the flow he's going in is very laid back, especially compared to the rest of the album, so it kind of fits. I, this is probably the, the my least favorite beat for sure, definitely on the album up to this point, because all the rest of the beats have been absolute fucking fire as hell. But yeah, this one's kind of laid back, but that's but that's the flow he's going with too. He's, he's talking basically right now. He's just talking to everybody. Yeah. 
diabetes and right. instead of us die auto fat people yeah. for really truly over till this old like I say that. we should coddle fat people yeah, yeah here's a concept what? let's celebrate onset yeah. diabetes and we should coddle fat people here's a concept let's celebrate diabetes which is what they do which is what they do now fat people are coddled like it's some disease or something that there's no cure for. The cure is put the fucking fork down. Or, I mean, or don't get offended when people say something if you're not going to do it. I mean, guys, I'm fat. I'm a fat guy. I mean, not, you know, not to the level of like Lizzo and shit like that. But yes, I am an overweight person. But, and I mean, I, and I don't go on diets. I don't, I don't exercise. I used to exercise. I used to be in shape when I was boxing uh, over 10 years ago. I was in the best shape of my life and I felt better than I ever, than I ever have in my life. More, more healthy, everything. So, I mean, but I was fat before then. I started working out, started running, started training. I lost like 40 pounds and I, I felt the best I ever did in my life. Now, since then, since I stopped boxing, because I didn't have the discipline for it at all, I could not continue to not eat the foods I wanted. I could not continue to eat as healthy as I should in order to maintain that type of lifestyle, because I just love bad food too much. So that ended, and I gained all that weight back very quickly and more, and I am very big now compared to that, for sure. But if somebody wants to call me fat, how could I disagree with that? How could I be offended by that? That's crazy. I am fat. I know I'm fat. So you can either, if you're upset about it and people making fun of you, you can do one of two things. You can either do something about it, lose the weight if it bothers you that much, which is kind of crazy that you, you let people affect you that much, to be honest. Or, it, or if you're not going to do that, then shut the fuck up about it and just accept the fact that you're fat and some people are going to notice that and say something sometimes and don't be offended because that's just your choice to do that <laughs> instead of Let's us go. dieting we can just have a pie eating contest uh, it should be extra nice instead of instead of dieting instead of put, put instead of trying to get people on diets let's just have a pie eating contest and celebrate the fatness that's what he's saying Honest, and yeah. instead of exercise, what? it's easier to find a triple, triple X exercise. Inside. That's crazy. Press society to change so you don't have to change. Pick up a way to eat less than price. Make your blood pressure rise as Ooh. it starts increasing. All that starts increasing. Yeah. Clock arteries, and these are the reasons for your heart disease. Ooh. And can't tie your shoe. Arteries are the reasons. He's flipping, a, he's flipping the words around again to where they kind of sound the same, but they are different, but he's making them sound the same. He's insane with this, with this wordplay. That starts in Greece and clock are the reason. These are the reasons. Clock are the reason. These are the reasons. Oh my God. For your heart disease and can't tie your shoes. Why? It's too hard to reach them. But the way things been, what? with today's thinking, yeah. we should baby them Why? instead of shaming them. Oh. But enabling can yeah. do more harm than good. So call me abling. Thank Oh my God. Uh -uh. Nope. Nope. He's canceled. He's canceled for sure now. He's canceled for sure. He's saying enabling them can be more harmful than good. And it is. Because people are told now to be proud of being fat. I mean, that, you know, uh, look what happens on social media. When a girl, uh, a girl that's like 105, 110, 115 pounds, a fucking supermodel, gorgeous looking girl, who's, do who's done, you know, hard work to look that way, eating right, worked out, put in, put in the work and time to, to look that way. And I mean, so, some of them have to work more than others. You know, some people are just blessed with, you know, not, not having to do all that and they can still look that good and shit like that. And they show themselves off. They get shamed. Some fat ass jumps on a 200 pound woman or something wearing fucking shorts and, uh, swimsuits and stuff. She has no business wearing and she gets praised for it. The other girl gets slut shamed and stuff like that, but not the fat bitch. It's crazy. All right, let's go. Yeah. Oh, I love this. I love this. Even though I'm not crazy about the beat. Oh my God, he's talking. Let's go. Blinking, cause I'll be honest. Hold on. I can flip and they blink. Hold on. Good. So call me a blinking, oh, okay. cause I'll be honest. I honest a blinking. Okay. All I need is one little road rage mm. reason. Yeah, blah blah blah. Let's go. Yeah. Give me a road rage reason to black the fuck up. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. These people, if you're fat, proud of me. 
Uh oh, hold on, he's about to go in again. All right, so yeah, I didn't hear that the first time, the end of the chorus. Um, wait a minute, what was it? Now I don't remember. I already forgot it, but I knew it was hard. Yeah. Oh yeah, F the red light, I'm trying to get even. All right, gotcha. Yeah, so hey, I, 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 I'm in rage mode. I'm in revenge mode. So whatever happened, yeah, I'm going through that red light. I'm not paying attention to nothing. So yeah, that's that's a hard chorus, so all right. My obese people, if you're fat, proud, and you know it. Raise your hand if you're shoving food in your mouth. Smoke it. Mm. What is your mad? Because the clown and you for pounding them donuts. What? Put them down and either do something about it or own it. What did I say? What did I say? say what did i just say a couple minutes ago oh my god what yes oh come on no he's being too honest you had the honest abe line of course wow oh he is going crazy oh i love this i love this <laughs> The clown and you for pounding the Hold donuts. On. We got no. All obese people, if you're fat, proud, and you know it. All obese people, if you're fat, proud, and you know it. And then listen. Oh my God, this punchline here. Raise your hand if you're shoving food in your mouth. Smoke it. <laughs> Clowning you for pounding them donuts, what? put them down and either do something about it or own it. Or own it, exactly. Okay. Or own it and shut the hell up about it. You can be fat and just, you choose to be fat. Hell, I choose to be fat. I don't work out. I don't eat right because I don't have the time and energy to do it anymore. So, I this is a choice for me to be this big. But damn, so yes, and own it. And shut the hell up about it. Don't be offended when people say something about it. Or if it bothers you to that point, to where you're hurt, to where you're offended, it, it messes with your head for some reason that much. People saying shit about it. You can do something about it. If it bothers you that much, do something about it. Put the donuts down. Get in the gym. Go run. Eat better. It's possible. <laughs> it's not a disease. Here we Wait, go. What are you doing? Uh -oh. What does it look like Wait. I'm doing? Okay, he's no. talking. Him and Shady are talking. Uh oh, uh oh. Let's go. Fuck up. He never... said we're dyeing our hair. Okay, the blonde hair's coming back, so it's definitely Shady now. The transition's complete. I said shut the fuck up. Okay, let's go. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Here we go. Transgender rights. Where do I stand? Oh, uh, I'm all for him. I really am pro. Nah, for but real. in the course, would you what? what I have? No, nope. I'm just being honest. Yeah. Now nah, I'm an asshole. Oh, I'm <laughs> a transphobe. Because really? yeah, I just can't go. What? And try and pretend you was never a man, though. Sorry. I mean, damn, bro. Yeah. Just the way nope. I feel. Uh, but if nope. I He's done. He's done. Nope. You're done. M, you're getting your wish. You're going to be canceled now. Nope. You said the most offensive thing on earth now. You said that a man is still a man no matter what. Yeah, now he started, I was a little worried when he started it off. Now he could have been kind of being a little sarcastic there. Or he could be saying, hey, I am for the rights of them. They're people. You know, they're still people. So they deserve the same rights as everybody else. That's And he could mean that. He probably does. But don't ask me to date or have intercourse with a guy who says he is a woman now. I'm not going to pretend that he's not a man. Come on. That's just the way I feel. You can. They feel the way they feel, which is crazy as it is, but why can't I feel the way I feel? Now I'm canceled. Now I'm a transphobe because I wouldn't date a damn man. What? Okay. Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. He's talking. Everybody needs to hear this shit. Really? Cause I just can't go what? and try and pretend you was never a man. Man, though, though you sorry, still are. Bro. Yeah, just the way I, I feel. feel. Uh, but if I say it will, hmm. it get be canceled. Yep. Does it get banned? What? Or can what? it withstand? The huh? shit is quicksand. Oh, man, I'm just saying. What? I gotta participate for us to coexist. Damn. Woo. I gotta memorize pronouns of a cis man. Really? How come we just can't show solidarity with a wristband or something like that? You know, this ain't even a diss. Yeah. Why does it have to be so out in the open and pushed, shoved in our faces, shoved down our throat? Pause. <laughs> All right. Why does it? Yeah. They used to just like do quiet little things like to, to show solidarity, like to show you support them or support that that stuff, whatever it may be, you know, like wear a wristband, something just little, just something, just something little, but it still is out there as a message. Now it's all in our face, movies, shows, music, videos, whatever. 
It's everywhere. It's insane. Oh, thank you, Eminem. Oh my God. And guys, we know he leans on the left side, who are the main, who are the main, um, uh, 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 I'm trying to think of the word, um, protectors, not protectors, but who are the main, um, damn, uh, <laughs> what the hell is the word? Not opposition, but who are the main, um, allies. Damn, I could not think of the word. Who are the main allies of all this shit? You know, the left side, who he aligns with, definitely more so than the other side. And I mean, I don't, you know, he, he does, I don't think he's ever really actually supported a politician or voted from what I hear. But um, yeah, we know he definitely falls more to the left side, but it's definitely not because of that shit. It's because of the race stuff and everything. With, but um, yeah, he's, I mean, he's just telling the truth. He's just saying how he feels. Why should that be a problem? And he's speaking facts. I mean, he's saying, I am not going to be with a man who now calls himself a woman. For one thing, he's not a woman. And he's not going to pretend that he was never a man, which he's still a man, of course, but that's the way the rhyme went, and that's, that's how he worded it. So, oh, my God. Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. Last album of Eminem, for sure. Friends, people, my dick just won't expand. Them tits won't make it stand. Hold on. Caitlin's big fan. Oh, Lord. And this ain't even a diss trans. Everybody with a wristband. Or okay. Like that, you know and this ain't even a diss trans. People, my dick just won't expand. Them tits won't make it stand. But Caitlin's <laughs> big fan. No, Oh, you want me to fucking chill and turn oh. down, huh? Hold up. So that way he ended it, yeah. So what like a man that gets gets those, you know what he said, implanted on him. Hey, it's not gonna make mine mine stand or expand because you're a dude. <laughs> this guy oh lord all right now what is he doing here is this what i think it is, is am i hearing this song right hold on expand the tits will make it stand but caitlin's big fan but he threw a little he threw a little sarcasm in there caitlin big fan okay but not you know not really obviously all right let's go oh you want me to fucking chill and tone this shit down huh Okay, Juvenile, yeah, classic song. Juvenile's first major hit, I guess, in 1998, ha. So, and he's rapping like him too, kind of sounding like him. He sounds like he's going to say ha after everything, or ha, huh, whatever, <laughs> however you want to pronounce it. But yeah, that, oh man, classic back in the day. Yeah, that was like late 98, I remember that coming out. Of course, Juvenile had been around for a while, but I think that was his first like jump into the mainstream, I believe. And that's what propelled Cash Money to just to go crazy back then. All right, let's go. Wish he grow up and not be so juvenile, huh? Mm. Cash money records, this shit's about to go south, huh? Okay. You feel stupid now, huh? Old Slim would have told him to put a lid on it like a toilet bowl rim. Woo! Hat the low brim. I'm in the blue corner. My trunks with the gold trim. They bet that I won't win. Guess you really show him. Mm. You the best animated like adult swim. Yeah, but Woo! you can't handicap people with no limbs. Hold on. Became the best and I made it. Like Adult Swim, that's like the Cartoon Network thing in it, or like the a, the a different network, I'm not sure, or like a, just a certain type of show that's on there. They call it Adult Swim because it's more grown up, I guess. I I'm not sure exactly what that bar is. Animated like Adult Swim. Well. Yeah, but you pick on. And I made it. Animated like Adult Swim. And I made it like Adult Swim, and and became the best. And I made it like Adult Swim. Animated, animated. It's animation shows, Cartoon Networks. Oh, I'm glad I rewound that because I didn't Adult catch it. Swim. Yeah, but you pick on handicapped people with no limbs. What the fuck, you Chris Reeves and the horse that he rode in, bitch. <laughs> God. Oh, Christopher Reeves, he can't even rest in peace. Poor guy. Damn. Oh man. F him and the, who was a cripple, of course, and the horse you rode in. Of course, he that's how he got crippled by falling off a horse, a horse riding accident. But damn, man, damn, leave Superman alone. Come on. <laughs> he's never going to leave him alone, even when he's gone and dead. That's crazy. But anyway, oh, my God, Eminem. Whew.
That, that was very, very enjoyable. Man, I loved every second of that. Wow, nobody could say that and get away with it but Slim Shady himself. Damn, that's crazy. And now if they do, which you know people are trying to cancel him for this, absolutely. And he's probably going to be, I mean, Eminem can't be canceled, but I don't know. I don't know after that one. That was, <laughs> that was tough. Um, but hey, he's got the fallback. It's not me. It's... It, that's not me. That's not how I feel. I'm Slim Shady. That's him. That's my alter ego. Come on. I'm not really saying that. <laughs> All right, guys. Let me know what you think of that. That. Oh, man. I know. I know. I know you guys had to love that one. If you're an Eminem fan, that's just classic, classic stuff. All right, guys. I'm going to get out of here before they come and cancel me, too, on my little ass channel. All right. I'm gone, guys. Uh, like I say, as always, you know, thanks to God, of course, for everything. Thanks to each and every one of you. Blessings on each each one of you. I speak it right now in the name of Jesus, God Almighty. I speak blessings on each and every one of you guys. I love you guys to death. Uh, be careful out there. Just stay safe. All right. I'm gone, guys. <laughs>